Hey guys, Rob here at Team X-Force. Um, just like Jace has brought you an update to his Yugi deck, I've got some updates on my Joey deck as well. Um, obviously yesterday was a very exciting day for us in the X-Force. Um, Dragon's Legend 2 came out and with it, fucking loads of new cards and that's what I've got added into the deck now, which I'll take you through. First of all, we've got Lord the Red, one of Joey's new rituals from the Wake of the Dragon series, as is Paladin of Dark Dragon, both of those secret, as is, a bit of a segue here, Red Eyes Black Dragon from the Tin, Cybertech so Alligator, Guild for the Lightning, Jinzo, BPT, same as Red Eyes, The Fiend Mega Cyber, Maximum Six, Axe Raider, and a very new addition to the deck here, something I'm very proud of. Thank you to Jason for helping me secure this. A super rare alligator sword, very, very rare from WP11, which I think is some sort of world promotional pack or something like that. It's very, very rare and, uh, well, it cost a pretty penny. Um, and linking on from that, Baby Dragon, super rare. I'm hoping to be getting super rare alligator sword dragon. Um, so I can use Super Poly to fuse Super Baby and Super Alligator Sword to form a Super version of the Fusion. Marauding Captain, Time Wizard, Sasuke Samurai, Goblin Attack Force, Pamper Warrior, Gear Freed the Iron Knight, Blue Flame Swordsman, keeping with Wake and the Dragons, Rocket Warrior, Little wing guard, and now we move on to the spells and a very special new addition to the deck again, thanks to Dragons of Legend 2, the Chlorohermos. So happy to have this, and I will take you through the fusion shortly. But main deck at the moment, that's the main spell. It looks incredible in 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 secret. It looks really really nice. Silent Doom again, secret. Same for scapegoat. Graceful Dice, Dangerous Machine Type 6, Polymerization, another new addition, and this card has already proved to be so fun. Both if you get a good effect or a bad effect, it's fantastic. We'll let Spider used in Battle City. Red Eyes, Transmigration, in order to get Lord of the Red out, and then Dark Dragon Ritual for Night of Dark Dragons. Um, I might not necessarily run always run them together. Uh, some people might say, oh, it's a bit dodgy using two rituals in one deck, but for the time being, they're new cards, I want to try them out. Metal Morph, the correct art that Joey uses in Waking the Dragons, the alternate art, and I've got that in Secret Rare. Bottomless Trap Hole. Skull Dice. Magical Arm Shield. And following up, coincidentally, actually, I didn't actually uh, put it this way, Double Magical Arm Bind. Again from the new set, Kunawa Chain, Grave Robber, Drop Off, Super, Neutron Z, Fairy Box, and Gamble. That's it for the main deck. Uh, go on to Fusions now. Got the Red Eyes. Black Dragon Sword, one of the new secret uh, Hermos fusions from Dragon's Legend 2. Also got Rocket Hermos Cannon, and Time Magic Hammer. Um, a question was raised to me as to why I'm not using Goddess Bow. Um, I'm not using it because Joey doesn't use it. I'm sticking to the three main ones that he does use. Um, Thousand Dragon, Black Skull Dragon, or B Skull Dragon. Guilty of the D Knight, Flame Swordsman, which I need in Super, and Alligator Sword Dragon. Again, hopefully, going to get that in Super. Tokens next, just simple, the four ultra standard scapegoat tokens, and I'm hoping to pick up the ultra rare scapegoat from Retro Pat to match up to those. I've also got here. Um, the dice, skull and graceful dice, respectively. 
um, as seen on the on on the card art. I'm quite happy with these, and it's perfect for Joey Dett of all the gambling cards. And then we just have now one last pile of just extra stuff, my collection uh, stuff I put in and out of the deck when I feel like it. Legendary Fisherman, Premature Burial, Swamp Battle Guard, Sword Hunter, Necromani King, Fortress Whale, Gear Freed the Swordmaster, Monster Reborn, Release Restraint, Gift from Weevil, Parasite Parasite, Lava Battle Guard, Salamandra, Leo Gun, Dark Magician Knight, Virtual World style, and again, Virtual World, a Harpist Feather Duster, hoping to get the super of that, but it is mega expensive. Gruzis, Possessed Joey, Raigeki, Ibusa Knight, and again, Possessed Hinotama times two, and there is a third one in this pile. Pot of Greed, I do have a secret Pot of Greed for Joey, but it's currently with the uh, with the Marit deck. Uh, Knight's title, secret. Insect Queen, again from Weevil. Swordsman Landstar, the third Hinotama. And to finish it off, Meteor of Destruction, uh, again for Possessed Joey. Um, hopefully you like the vid, we'll keep you updated. Any new releases, if we've got anything to do with characters, we'll always do new vids for to give you an update. Let us know what you think, give us a comment, and uh, hope you enjoyed it.